Joe Biden has officially been sworn in as our 46th President of the United States. He officially took his oath of office at 11.48 a.m. with Kamala Harris taking her oath at 11.42 a.m. Kamala Harris has made history as the first woman vice president as well as the first woman of color vice president. Biden has already gotten to work on his first day signing executive actions, one of his first steps being to address the coronavirus pandemic. He has also stopped funding for the infamous border wall, which had started being built during the Trump administration. He's also reversed the travel bans that were set in place, mostly for Muslim countries. In his inaugural address, he addressed America and its people multiple times and how we need to come together as one. Unity was one of the biggest themes, and I'd like to take a second to recite a part of his speech. We can see each other not as adversaries, but as neighbors. We can treat each other with dignity and respect. We can join forces, forces, stop the shouting, and lower the temperature. For without unity, there is no peace, only bitterness and fury. No progress, only exhausting outrage. No nation, only a state of chaos. This is our historic moment of crisis and challenge, and unity is the path forward. Let's hope Joe Biden can keep his promises and unite us to the best of his ability. I'm Kwana and thank you for watching Anchor TV.